I am Juliana Gospodaru. I am um, an architect and a fine art photographer. I am mostly working with architecture, also with landscape photography, but architecture is my passion and what I am mostly known for. Most of my work is in black and white, even if I like color, but I am expressing myself much better in black and white. So this is mo the most part of my work is following this, um, this style. I'm organizing workshops um, on architectural photography, black and white photography, fine art photography. I'm generally doing educational work in photography. I work with students. I lecture around the world and this is also part of my photography, not only creating photography but also sharing my knowledge and helping other people get better with their photography and realizing their vision in photography. I mean I was sharing my work and this just came. I didn't prepare for a business in photography. I was I, actually I'm still working in architecture but um, because of the situation with the recession and everything at that point, the amount of project was going down, so I had a little bit more time. I, I started sharing my work publicly while I was working in photography for many years before, but that was the point when I started being more active publicly. And people started asking me if I can mentor them, if I can work with them. It was quite a few years ago when there, wasn't, there weren't too many people doing this. So. It was in the beginnings of uh, black and white photography and uh, architecture photography. So that's how I, I got to be in, in the first wave of black and white architecture photographers working with digital. And then one thing brought another and it just grew from there. I started doing workshops, I started working on a book, doing different courses. Um, starting online mentoring. So I put what I was doing already, traveling, doing photography, I made it more more public. And then because I liked what I was doing, I liked all the all the process and people were happy, little by little it started becoming a business. I mean I started doing it as a business, but it, it wasn't meant necessarily to be. Now it is. Architecture somehow became secondary, I mean designing. And uh, actually that's that's something that I always wanted to do different things in my life. So <laughs> it came so somehow life helps you do this and gives you inspiration. So yeah, I'm, I'm really happy about um, the point I am right now. One of the things I love about photography is that uh, it allows me to travel. So I have two big passions or anyway, two or three, but <laughs> the two big passions are travel and photography. So one, uh, allows me to do the other so that's a great thing about photography you, you have the, a reason to travel if you're uh, doing photography and you have a re reason to photograph if you're traveling so um, this is why I like to travel and I like to go to the best to the most beautiful uh, cities in the world uh, Europe in um, United States in Asia and try to get the, the most in terms of uh, not only in terms of photography but also in terms of, of knowing uh, the culture and understanding the people understanding the life in those uh, parts of the world in New York in Los Angeles San Francisco Chicago in Europe um, London Paris Berlin uh, all these are cities that not only give you uh, reasons to do photography but give you reasons to to know the culture to to understand the ideas and the people and what is happening in um, in those countries and these are things that help us evolve as um, not only as photographers as and as artists but as people and this is one of the things I'm uh, looking for in photography is to become a better person to to know more to to find out um, the mystery of life.